Shortly, we are, we are starting with the fourth game of the day, last for the day. And two teams playing the last game. Is our lady of perpetual soccer high secondary for playing in green outfit versus savior of the world, Lutoli, who are playing in orange outfit. Referee for the last game, Xavier Clement will be assisted by Zuzari Bello and Cayetano Pereira. Fourth official is Camilo Baptist. Match commissioner for today's game is Joki Manuel De Silva. Can I have everyone's attention, please? Before the kickoff, we'll have a national anthem requesting anyone. We're into the second semi-final of uh, the Junior Boys here at the Reliance Foundation Youth Sports Fair. Our lady of purpose, Jules Saka High School, is taking on uh, the savior of the world high school. And the finalist, uh, the second finalist, is which would be chosen from the second semi-final. And they'd be playing against uh, Marina English High School. We are playing the national anthem requesting all the football lovers and spectators to arise. So, a big, big test for the players. And uh, it's time for the team huddle.
as you know the winner of this game uh, will be playing Marina English High School in the final of the junior boys category of Reliance Foundation Youth Sports So, time for the kickoff. Padianas, Padianas, Padianas. Padianas, don't down now. And that's the game. It's uh, Savior of the World uh, who are now operating from the left to right of your monitor. So it's a foul throw. chance for Sevilla of the world to put pressure on the opposition. Ryan Souza with a goal kick. Tried to sneak in through with a pass, but he couldn't. <coughs> this is probably the most ideal condition to play quality football among all the games which I've seen today in the semi finals. Pleasant weather. The heat has gone down as well. Out. Your perpetual on the attack. Somehow cleared of the line. In the last couple of months, all these teams. Uh, have played their best football to see themselves in a where a victory can uh, secure their plate in the place in the final. Hong Grand Jeffrey, but he didn't have the power, not the placement. That's the slogan. Come on in. To all the young footballers, to show showcase their talent. Reliance Foundation Youth Sports. Good composed header. Lady of Perpetual on the move. Try to 
played the ball on the left, but uh, he couldn't do it in the end. Take a shot from there, no. Good pressure from the defender. Nicely played as well. But uh, that ball didn't have any purpose. Straight to the goalkeeper. Once again, a throw in. It hasn't been uh, as energetic start as it had in the previous game. Miss passes. Uh, Foul throws, infringement. Now a free kick. Once again, uh, a poor free kick. There was no player down there to attack that ball. Try to play the forward ball, but once again a miss pass. The first few minutes, miss passes uh, and regular intervals. Well, uh, now there is a chance for the saviour of the world. Nicely taken as well. Will this be the first goal? No. He was already in an offside position. Keeper. Good long kick. Snatched it really well. Played it forward. This is a very good opportunity. Will this be the first goal? Yes, it is. Brilliant finish. And look at that celebration. Must be a big Cristiano Ronaldo fan. But uh, this is an excellent finish. Look at that. Took the ball. Look at that finish. The goalkeeper came off his line very quickly. So it was a bit difficult for him to really get the ball. But he still managed to put a toe into it. Jesse number seven, Valerie Fernandez, has given a lead to Sevilla of the world Lutoli. And uh, it's a Felroy Fernandez who scored the opening goal.
that has uh, got a goal it's to see whether the goal can uh, put a life into this game otherwise uh, in the first few minutes it had been uh, some wave of football from both the teams and suddenly against the break of play it's savior of the world who took the lead through Velroy Fernandez Again, uh, it's savior of the world. And uh, we're into the eleventh min minute of the game, and we have already got a goal. Again, a wave of clearance. The ball already had crossed the line, so a throw in. Meanwhile, two footballs are there on the pitch. It's a good run from uh, the goal scorer. Nice skills. Twisting, turning. Now it's time for our lady of perpetual to counter. And they have got a good chance as well. Did he take a shot from there? He took. But uh, very nicely blocked. kick taken but uh, didn't come off uh, from that set piece movement another chance swing floater but uh, it's well over the bar look at that it was the cross Intended to find the man who was there on the second post, but in the end, it didn't happen. Again, clearance. Advice. It's severe the world on the attack, but we have seen uh, probably the maximum number of missed passes in the junior boys uh, semi finals if we combine the first two one. A long kick take. Now it's 
uh, Lady of Perpetual on the attack from the right flank. Throw in. On the right, good skills, but a miss pass once again uh, caused the growth of that attack. Meanwhile, it's Sevier the world on uh, the counter attack, bustling with speed, uh, and in the end, on the corner kick. crowd here at uh, the today's football stadium in Goa it's in Flotter but uh, not a good head on the location while the ball is still there with them again an attempt to play a forward ball and that too a long ball which uh, didn't come off Free kick. Let's see whether they can uh, double their lead through the set piece or not. Not a dangerous one, so no problems in the end. Ball free kick in favor of. Uh, Savior of the world. Remember, they are leading this game uh, by a solitary goal scored by Velroy Fernandez in the eighth minute of the game. Another chance, but he was already in an offside position. Mistimed uh, his run completely. Well, it's Our Lady of Perpetual it's trying to put pressure on the defence. Nice interception. The battle is still going on. Once again, a wave of clearance. No cohesion in the midfield from both the teams. There's just one sudden counter attack which uh, helped uh, the savior of the world to take the lead. Otherwise, none of the teams have uh, impressed uh, the spectators who have come to watch this game. Win in favor of uh, Savior of the World.
Okay. Dance on the break. It's Savior of the World uh, on the attack. Good chance to double the lead. Will he take a shot? Appeal for a penalty. But nothing given. That was the incident. Certainly there was a push, but uh, the referee felt it was not uh, as heavy as it can uh, award him a penalty. Meanwhile, uh, a cooling break is going on. As uh, the player is lying injured. That was the incident. Savior of the world uh, has been good in counter attacks, but otherwise, there is no cohesion so far in both the teams' uh, attacking moves. This is good skills. And uh, another set piece opportunity. Once again, an aimless pass. There has been no... This is a good chance. Can he provide a good cross from there? No. Fine piece of defending. But so far, both the teams have been very much average. Not a corner kick. In swing floater. The header was on. But straight to the throat of the goalkeeper. Showing in favour of uh, our lady of perpetual. In the final touch uh, was very poor. This is better. Nice wall play. This is much better from uh, Savior of the World, but that was just over the bar. It was never an uh, intentional uh, effort to be precise. It tried to make a cross from there. Couldn't quite connect it. Look at that. It tried to put a cross down there. In the end, uh, it finished on the top of uh, the roof of the goalpost.
Detroit. So a corner kick in favor of uh, Our Lady of Perpetual. The first one after a long while. And swing floater, but no problem in the end. A shot taken, and what a goal that was! Breathtaking individual effort. And uh, Our Lady of Perpetual are right back into this game. Look at that shot. This is a phenomenal goal. Absolutely ineffable stuff. Magnificent strike. Uh, it's uh, one all here. And the second semi final. And uh, now it's Savior of the World who are there on the attack. Good uh, full blooded challenge. It was uh, Jose Ricci. Who equalized for the Lady of Perpetual? Just in number seven, Jose Ricci. Have equalized for Our Lady of Perpetual Soccer Higher Set. Another interruption in the game. It's another throw in and uh, it's Savior of the World. I've got the throw in. Right now it's one all here and we are approaching towards the half time mark. Less than a minute to go for the stipulated uh, 30 minutes. Again, it's uh, our Lady of Perpetual who are there on the attack. Throw in. And uh, once again, an interruption. A long throw in. Again, uh, a wasted through ball to be, to be precise, and then another throw in. In an 
agricultural clearance. Nice chest trap. Savior of the world on the attack. Nice interception. Well, that was a rash challenge. I made it one minute. So one minute, one minute added uh, to the stipulated time. Well, that was uh, indeed an ugly challenge. The man who is lying down is uh, Seven Costa. That was the challenge. Look at that. Without ball challenge. Almost stamped with his boot. It's one all here between our lady of the perpetual love and uh, Savior of the world. The hitter was there. A looping one. But wasn't on target. Well, that was uh, the safe piece opportunity. And uh, that was the header. So the referee whistles for the half time. And as it stands. It's one all between uh, Our Lady of Perpetual and Saviour of the World. Two classic goals we have seen today in this game. It was uh, Saviour of the World who took the lead on the 8th minute of the game. But later on it's uh, Our Lady of Perpetual who crawled back into this game uh, with a fascinating finish. And that too by Jose Ricci. In case you missed the actions of the first half. Here goes the highlights for you. Well, that was uh, the finish or rather the wasted opportunity this was the chance which was executed to perfection look at that finish just uh, tapped when it mattered the most the goalkeeper was out of his line very quickly, but he was even quicker nice finish uh, by Velra Fernandez Look at that celebration. Reminds me more of Cristiano Ronaldo. That was the appeal for a penalty, but uh, not given. Corner kicks. Straight to the throat of the goalkeeper. That was a miscued shot. And that was the goal. Absolutely. Fascinating stuff. Rocketed uh, at the back of the net. And look at the celebration. It's, it says it all. How much it meant to them. First half of the game. Two goals have been scored. Savior of the world, Lutolini took the lead through. Valroy Fernandez, Jesse number seven. And Our Lady of Perpetual Saka equalized through Jesse number five, Jose Ricci. After a break of 10 minutes, we'll start with the second half of the game.
First game tomorrow, what time will it start? Kalka Pahela game, what time will it start? In the second. A gap of 90 minutes in between. Tomorrow, 90 minutes game. Senior team tomorrow. It's uh, the start of the second half. This is better from uh, the Lady of Perpetual. This is good. Played it forward. Need a good cross from there. Will he take a long ranger? He tried, but straight to the goalkeeper. Free kick in favor of uh, Savior of the World. All these young lads are the prospect of Indian football in future. And what an opportunity they have been getting. A cross came in. Almost. Almost the second goal. Great in swing floater. It was clutch. It's still one all here at the Dulair Football Stadium at Goa. And the second semi final of uh, the junior boys category in the Reliance Foundation Youth Sports. It has been, uh, as we are mentioning time and again, a phenomenal platform for all these youngsters to showcase their talent. The ball had already crossed to the line, so a throw in in favor of uh, Savior of the World. A 
Regina Troyne. Once again, uh, another throw in, this time in favour of uh, Our Lady of Perpetual. Nice turn. Once again. Not the ideal way to clear the ball. Hence, Savior of the world are there still with the pressure. Well, a forward ball. Nice clearance. Good to see the body language of both the teams in the second half. You're trying uh, to do something innovative, something special. Kick taken. Now it's Savior of the World on the attack. Ricochet. Referee blows his whistle. Free kick uh, in favor of uh, Our Lady of Perpetual. The coach uh, is not at all happy with that incident. The youngsters uh, have a lot of dreams in their eyes. And Reliance Foundation Youth Sports has been uh, giving them the platform to make those dreams into reality. long throw in another long ball intended this is a good uh, fast uh, counter attack from the right wing but the defense was agile Try to do too many walks over there. This is nice skills. He was in an offside position, so the flag uh, from the assistant referee was there. Yes, uh, this angle cannot tell that, but he was certainly in an offside position. Another wayward clearance. For each and every ball that has been a hallmark of this game. But in terms of uh, the 
quality of football it has been uh, nice skills oh this is uh, very nicely done but once again it was off target goal kick in favor of uh, savior of the world look at that this is silky skills then the shot but off target the referee blows the whistle and then uh, an infringement free kick in favor of uh, savior of the world the score line remains the same it's one all here at the Dulair football stadium players are taking too long time to take uh, every set piece movement but in terms of the semi-final performance Marina English High School were already there in the final has produced uh, much better football in the first semi-final compared to these two teams long ball played this is uh, much better straight to the goalkeeper at that you can never score a goal from that range straight to the goalkeeper this is much better from our lady of perpetual at least they are trying to play some passes sir uh, in the attacking zone good skills not a convincing clearance but uh, freaky given Both the teams are struggling to create an attack right at the moment. Well, this is better. Good run from the right. Another shot, but straight to the goalkeeper. The shot certainly had the power to trouble the goalkeeper. This time, another move. To our Lady of Perpetual. Look at that shot. The goalkeeper could find himself lucky that the ball came straight to him. And while a player is lying down, and uh, he's Brentson Fernandez from uh, Savior of the World. That is what happened. Oh, that looks ugly. Trip from behind, strict uh, kick on his right, right leg to be precise. And uh, a free kick in favor of uh, 
Savior of the World. Well, uh, there was a fumble from the goalkeeper. He himself went for the glory from that distance, which didn't come in the end. Throw it. Much better football. Well, what a chance that was. Takes the shot. Just wide. He came uh, perilously close. Good technique. Just wide. So the first yellow card of this game has been shown. And a free kick in favour of uh, Saviour of the World. Myron Pacheco is taking the free kick. Well, this is better. Good dribbling. Well, uh, a player is uh, down there. The shot certainly had the power and it went straight to hit his chest. Substitution is about to come and it's uh, Salihin uh, Rathor who is coming in and it's to see who is going out. It's uh, Clasho Pacheco who had gone out. Substitution for Savior of the world, Lutoli, Jesse number eight, Clasio Pacheco is replaced by Jesse number 16, Sachin Rathod. That's the confirmation. Clasio Pacheco came out and Sachin Rathod had come uh, as a substitute. Try to play a forward through. Unless something miracle happens, this game has all the probabilities of going towards the penalty shootout.
again a throw in. So that's the confirmation. Vijay Vasudevan, the goal scorer, has now been booked. Again, an agricultural theory. Free kick given, yes, for the elbow. Once again, straight to the goalkeeper. Again, uh, savior of the world lost the control of the ball. Last 10 minutes to go for the stipulated uh, six minutes. So free kick in a very good position. Need to deliver a good delivery, Johanne. Oh, just uh, just over the bar. He should have uh, gone for a curling in swing cross, which he didn't. He went for the glory. And it wasn't on target. Forward through was intended, but there was no one to attack the ball. Another throw in. Another foul, entrenchment. Free kick for Our Lady of Perpetual. This time a better delivery. The header was there as well, but wasn't on target. That was uh, the replay of what happened uh, in that free kick.
Now a forward ball. Savior of the world under attack. No problems whatsoever for the opposition defense to clear it. Meaningless forward balls. He's doing no help. Uh, Well, will he take a shot? No. He tried to assist. Played it short. case the score line remains the same for the next five minutes it would be a penalty shootout going through the character of this game that is the most likely context uh, this game is to receive Another infringement, foul free kick for our lady of the perpetual. Well, now a good chance. Should go to test the goalkeeper, but the shot didn't have uh, the power to trouble him. Last two minutes uh, left in the regulation time. Again, uh, a visionless pass. I start. Again, a goal kick. A minute and a half to go. It's still one all here at the Tulare Football Stadium. Let Mafusa go up. Again, a vested ball played forward.
Another throw in. Another agricultural clearance. Again a throw in. Cross, but uh, straight to the goalkeeper. Added time, two minutes. So two minutes to go. Failing to decide the tie or regular time. Tie will be decided with the kicks taken from the penalty spot. Once again a forward ball played. Whipped away from the defence. after a long long while that was uh, a dangerous move created again a long ball <laughs> tried to test him from a distance but it went well over the bar Less than 30 seconds to go. And if the score line remains the same, which is uh, most likely to be happened, we might see the first uh, penalty shootout of the semi final clash today. Probably the last throw on the dice. And that goes the whistle from the referee. And it's uh, the penalty shootout which will. Uh, well, the tie will be decided. Decide the fate of uh, one of these two teams from the penalty for the spot. final spot. So the final score remains one all between uh, our lady of perpetual and savior of the world even though both the teams played uh, some very poor football but the goals which we have witnessed are no doubt uh, brilliant in any, any, any standard see whether the heroics of the goalkeepers can secure the fate of uh, either of these two teams remember a winner from uh, this encounter We'll play the final against uh, Mariana English uh, High School, or rather Marina English High School.
So the dramatic penalty shootout uh, is about to begin. And it would be Savior of the World who would be taking the first shot. Let's see whether he can give the lead from the first shot or not. Savior of the world. And he scores. That's the first goal from the penalty shootout. And uh, Savior of the world takes the lead. Branson Fernandez scores the first goal from the penalty spot. And Savior of the world is leading by two goals to one. Now it's a turn for our Lady of Perpetual. She equalized in a penalty shootout. And it's uh, Feliston Tavares. Oh, this is a beautiful penalty. Jesse number four, Feliston Tavares. Hits it's the one target. All here in the penalty shootout. Both the teams have scored one goal each from the penalty spot. Perfect penalty. The goalkeeper was completely wrong footed. Now oh, it's two all here. In fact, uh, one all in the penalty shootout. And Steve Gomes. And another goal. Very fine penalty. Interesting thing is that he himself is uh, going there to save the penalty this time around. Now uh, the goal scorer, Vijay Vasudevan, scored a Now it's uh, Another goal scorer, Velroy Fernandez. He'll be taking this shot. Oh, the goalkeeper dived on the perfect direction. It was Velroy out of Fernandez his reach, and it's 4 3 in favor of Sevilla. the lead to Sevilla of the world again. The goalkeeper guessed it uh, rightly. Our Lady of Perpetual. And another goal. It's four Person all here. 11. Kanai Kamji makes it three goals. Kanai Kanti. From the penalty spot. The goalkeeper was once again uh, wrong footed. And it's four all, four all here in the penalty shootout. It's a very important penalty this one. And he saves it. It was uh, Elvian Fernandez. Ryan Fernandez or rather failed to score. And giving the advantage to our lady of perpetual soccer. It's a great, great opportunity. 
to grab the place in the final for Our Lady of Perpetual. The deciding penalty. It's uh, Elvian and that's the goal. And that secures their berth in the final. No, no. Or is it? No, this is uh, the second last one. Elvian Fernandez. That Next gives seat. them the advantage. Four goals to three in favor of Our Lady of Perpetual Circle. Can he score from there? Another save. And there had been no requirement of the last shot. So, a very fine penalty. Myron Pacheco, just a number 14. Keeping the hopes alive for saviour of the world, Luto Lee. So, just a single shot saved. Otherwise, uh, all the penalty takers uh, have scored from the spot. Last shot. Can he score? Melroy. And he scores. Well, and look at the jubilation. Melroy Mora, just a number five. Is uh, our Lady of Perpetual to the finals. Who will play Marina English High School in the final? Look at that penalty. And they have snatched uh, the penalty shootout by 5-4, 6-5 overall. And aren't they happy? They were the team who conceded the first goal. And then crawled back with a brilliant goal by Vijay Vasudevan. And in the penalty shootout, they have got the last laugh. The pl game has been played uh, in high spirit. And that has been a big bonus for all the kids who have been watching this game. To equalize for Our Lady of Perpetual has been uh, selected for the player of the match all the penalties except the one which was shaved uh, was neatly taken look at that otherwise that was the last shot it sealed their fate. And look at the jubilation. Aren't they happy? And this is the full time scoreline. It's uh, Our Lady of Perpetual have snatched uh, the game through penalty shootout by 6 5 against uh, Severe of the World.
we have our man of the match today and we have match commissioner Joachim Manuel who will be giving away the prize to the man of the match. And the man of the match today is Vijay Vasudevan requesting Joachim to give away the prize to the man of the match. Congratulations Vijay. Vijay, congratulations. It was a tough game. After playing for 60 minutes, you'll have to go for the tiebreaker. What do you have got to say? And what is the precious moment? What is big trip for you today? He seems to say that that uh, we have played as a team and with that support of the players we have won the match and looking forward for the finals to win the tournament. Playing this precious tournament participating and what's your experience on this after the victory? Thank you for Reliance for giving us the opportunity to play in this tournament. Now coach, what's your thought today for the team's victory? Thought is teamwork and the team showed that for the full time we couldn't score but Somehow we managed and the players held their nerves to win at the penalties. Now you must be treating all these youngsters as kids, boys. What will you tell your boys now after the victory? Overconfidence is not that we see forward. It's all about hard work that will pay us when we play the finals. Thank you, Reliance Foundation Youth Sports. It's because of you we are all here today. Congratulations, and see you all tomorrow, all football lovers around.